to today's video. Now today I'm going to be doing something I haven't done in a little while. This is basically a product empties video. So it's basically everything that I've been loving sort of quite recently that I've run out of and I really need to repurchase again because I am obsessed with every single one of them. So I'm going to start off with um, skincare. I've actually only got one thing to show you for skincare today and oh my gosh this is like a dream. This is by Liz Earl and it is their um, Cleanse and Polish Hot Cloth Cleanser. This I am just obsessed with. It's like my go-to cleanser. It's absolutely epic. This one was actually a small size. This was a 50ml one. And basically, um, I just kind of use it to get rid of, after I've taken my makeup off and everything, I use it to sort of just pop all over my face and then obviously use like a muslin cloth or whatever, like a flannel, just to kind of then go over the top where it's nice and warm. And it basically you kind of like wipe all of the rubbish away from your skin from that day. And it just leaves your skin feeling feeling so, so cleansed, so soft, so like deeply cleansed, it's just amazing and I am just obsessed with this, so I'm definitely going to be repurchasing that one. Then, um, for my hair, so first of all, I'm going to go for um, the quick fix. <laughs> Everyone loves a bit of dry shampoo in between washes. Ah, this one is my favourite, this is by Batiste and it's their deep, um, dark and deep brown, sorry, so it's basically got a hint of colour to it. Since I've gone darker, I find using um, dry shampoo normally an absolute nightmare because it basically on dark hair looks like you've kind of got dandruff and it's really awkward or you look like a zebra so it's not really cool. So um, basically I found this one which has got a hint of kind of dark brown in there and it just means that when you pop it onto your roots and pop it all over the hair and then like rub it all in, it doesn't leave you looking like wow what's happened to her head it just kind of makes you um it kind of like actually blends in with your hair color which is really nice and also just refreshes it a little bit what i love about this one is that you can then kind of just like brush it out and it doesn't leave it feeling absolutely disgusting um it doesn't leave it like a matted mess or anything but it's just super good in between washes and i love it okay shampoo and conditioner wise i've talked to you guys a lot about this range and i've run out again so i just wanted to say i, I clearly do love this this is by icon and this this is their India um, range. Now this is actually the shampoo. I do use the conditioner as well. I'm obsessed with both of them. I have obviously a hair extensions in at the moment and they are Indian hair. So this is absolutely perfect for my hair extensions. Um, it's just been specifically designed for them and developed for them. This honestly leaves my hair feeling so soft and just beautiful. I honestly only have to wash it like once a week when I have this in and then obviously just use kind of dry shampoo or whatever when it's getting towards needing a good clean. Um, but honestly it just leaves my hair feeling absolutely insane. I've never had a shampoo or conditioner that can do this. So I've tried this recently and fallen in love with it. Basically when I ran out of my Icon conditioner I was like right I need something because I'm not going to be able to wash my hair. Panic. And I tried this and I loved it. This is by I think it's Nexus or Nexus. Zeus. I, you guys can probably tell me in the comments below how do you say this but it's absolutely incredible this is basically their nutri uh, I never know how to say this nutri nutri nutritive uh, I can't spell and pronounce stuff today um, and it's their nutritive replenishing see can't do it uh, nutritive replenishing system and it's their mask so this is basically um, it's kind of like really protein based so it's really heavily protein based so it kind of helps your hair to recover it's got caviar in there as well so it basically kind of like really nourishes it helps it to kind of like the protein obviously stimulates sort of hair growth um, and just kind of keeps it looking all lovely and beautiful also this one for me i really just wanted something to put a little bit of goodness back into it a little bit of moisture i do try and do a mask like once a week or once every couple of weeks um just to try and kind of rebalance everything again and just kind of plow it with moisture so this one for me is absolutely incredible and i love it so i'm definitely going to be trying that one again okay then moving on to some makeup um i've got a few different bits that um, i wanted to go through with you guys First of all, oh my gosh, I love this so much. I've been a massive fan ever since it first came out, you guys know. The Benefit Varial Push-Up Liner, OMG. I love this so much that I even said OMG. Love it. Anyway, this one is just in black. Why I love this liner so much is because honestly, trying to do flicks and stuff before, 
before this little beauty. I could not do it to save my life. And this honestly just makes it so easy. The consistency is just beautiful. It's kind of like a gel. So it's just really, really lush when it goes on. It's so easy to apply. And um, you can also like, you know, create how big you want it, like how thick, how thin you want the line. Um, it's so, so nice. And the end is really like ergonomically designed. So basically it's just kind of fits your lash line perfectly. I absolutely love this and also you can literally wear this all day and night and it will not move. So I am a massive, massive fan of this. Also I think it's waterproof as well because I've done a lot of crying with this on, you know, heartbreak and whatever else and uh, this doesn't go anywhere so I love it. So yeah, massive one for me, definitely gonna be needing some of that because I've just run out and I'm wounded. I'm like, no, what am I gonna do? Anyway, then to go with that as well, um, my favorite mascara has just literally gone and well I've used it all up it hasn't just gone uh, my lashes have obviously loved it so this is by Tarte and this is their lights camera flashes uh, mascara I am obsessed with this one I cannot even tell you how amazing it is first of all packaging uh, amazing love it um, it's basically for me it does like lengthening volumizing separates my lashes literally all in one go so what I kind of do is get really close to the lash line just sort of separate them first of all and then I kind of let that one set um, I kind of do one coat and then I go over the top again just to get a bit more volume so that's sort of how I do it and then obviously just um, pay special attention to the outer and inner ones I really like this I just think it's perfect for me it does everything I need a mascara to do and I'm gutted that it's run out um, I think they actually sell this on QVC though so I'll definitely be repurchasing that and it's an absolute steal on there so I love it okay then um, oh love this so much and I'm so again gutted that it's run out this is by Shiseido and this is my um, sheer eye zone corrector this one is actually in 102 light Claire, I think, light Claire. Anyway, basically this one is absolutely incredible. It's got like a little brush on the end and you basically twist the bottom. And what I use this for is a bit of highlighting. So it's almost like using concealer, but it's not quite as thick, so I really like that. Um, for me, all I do is just pop it underneath my eyes. I pop it on like my nose, around my T-zone here, and then a little bit on my Cupid's bow. And then I just kind of buff it in with a brush. And I do that over the top of my foundation. So it just makes it really nice where kind of light hits. It just kind of really reflects that and makes your face look a bit more contoured, I guess. So it's just kind of a bit of the highlighting kind of bit. But it's made super easy. It's like not really hard to do to kind of buff it into my skin. And I just absolutely love it. And the kind of look that it gives me afterwards is just lovely. So I need to repurchase that. Okay, then the last two bits. Oh, my favorite lip gloss has run out and I'm really upset. So this is basically by MAC and this is their Dazzle Glass lip gloss. And this one is in Moth to Flame, love that. So this one's just really, really pretty. It's like a brownie sort of colour, but it has loads of like shimmer bits in it, little bits of like glitter. Although they're not super annoying, like as in you're just gonna eat a block of glitter. Like they're not the um, the actual pieces. They've just kind of, I don't know how they do it, but they're really soft and you don't even notice that they're in there. For me, it's just really nice and shimmery. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I just pop it over, either wear it on its own, just with my normal lips. Or I can kind of put like a lip liner or lipstick underneath it, just nude. When I want a nude day, obviously not my birthday suit you know what I mean um that would tear that would scare a lot of people off uh but this is basically for when I don't want super bold lips and I want like today I've done my eyes a little bit darker so I just want quite a nude lip because I always kind of think you can't really have both at the same time so I really really love this also what I love about this is the wand it goes on so nicely it doesn't you don't have to work at it for ages because that's you know first world problems but that really annoys me um okay and then the final thing oh my gosh where would life be without this this is my fave time favorite whatever of all time makeup setting spray this one is by Urban Decay and um yeah it's their all-nighter makeup setting spray I love this because basically it's like oil free paraben free free it's just lovely it doesn't smell like chemically when it goes on your body on your face you basically just spray it sort of in the air um quite far away from your face because a lot does come out and then you can either walk into it or just kind of do it a little bit away from you and it just sets your makeup in place all night long or all day long and honestly this genuinely 
genuinely does work. So I absolutely love this, especially on like a night out and stuff like that. What I also love is that it doesn't kind of make your face like too greasy, it doesn't kind of like stick to certain bits, it's just absolutely perfect and it honestly does work, it keeps my makeup in place and I love it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, if you've got any recommendations that you guys have tried and used up and absolutely loved that you think I would love to, please write a comment below and let me know because I love to try what you guys recommend. If you want to go and see more of this face and you want to go and see my last video, click on this right now and that will take you back over to my What I Got For Christmas video, which is super exciting. I got so many goodies and I would love for you guys to see what I got. Um, in the meantime, give this video a massive thumbs up for me. Of course, subscribe to my channel as always and I will see you guys in a few days time in my next video bye guys so thank you so much if you're watching I love you so much and I cannot thank you enough for this present this is amazing oh, I'm gonna try and make you something Kimberly but it probably won't be that good so <laughs> don't get your hopes up